Hello, hello, Tatum here. Thank you for joining me today. I have a total body strength workout. So grab those dumbbells and let's get to it. All right, hello team. It's time to get started for today's equipment. We're gonna be using dumbbells, mostly kind of light to medium. I'm gonna be somewhere in that 15 to 20 pound range for most of this, okay? So not the big heavy lifts today. Um, I'm also gonna be using my plyo box for lateral step ups. You'll see a modification window. If you don't have a stepper, a box, or, or a low chair, sturdy chair, or bench to step up on, all right? All right, we gotta get moving here. Let's just go ahead, I want you to Bring your left arm out, right arm over the top. Give yourself a really big hug here, okay? And we're just gonna move those elbows up and down, up and down, just loosening up. This should feel good, hopefully to you. Maybe not to some. <laughs> oh, up and down. Now I want you to curl in, bring that chin down, rotate to the left, and rotate to the right. There you go. I don't have windows up for our warm up, so you're just gonna follow my lead. And we're just kind of moving. Let's switch now, right arm on bottom, left arm on top. Move up and down again with those elbows. There you go, just getting a little bit further each time. Nice big hug, ooh, there we go. <laughs> All right, we're gonna round out, drop that chin, just fall into kind of this rag, rag doll, hugging yourself, and then reach. If you can see this side to side, just give it a twist. You should feel that round the shoulder blade, down the side of the body. Three, two, and one, good. Now we're gonna interlace our fingers here, okay? I want you to lean back into a little bit of a back bend, and then we're gonna fall forward. Let's go wide with our feet. We're gonna bring those elbows in, we're gonna tuck our chin and pull down, all right? Just start working with me. Again, I'm not giving a good countdown, I just want you to watch and move. We're just kind of moving through here, opening up the hips, the shoulders, the chest the entire body here today, the spine. Oh yeah, good. Wrap it around, drop it in. You can bend your knees if that feels good, pulling that head towards the floor, but be careful. And back, we're gonna keep moving. Ooh, pop, did anybody pop their back? <laughs> back down, here we go. And up. Good, a couple more. Really just draw that head towards the floor, tuck that chin, feel that stretch. Reach back, oh, open those elbows. Last one here, down, and up, big breath. Oh, wow, that's good. Okay, if you're sore, I'm sore in my belly. That felt really good. We're gonna go over here. Little leg swings, you can hold onto the wall, kicking it forward and back, forward and back. There you go, we got about 30 seconds on this side, so we'll go, I'm gonna go here, but you can still hold onto the wall or a chair or a friend. <laughs> I wish I had a friend here today. I always ask my kids and they never join me. Let's go across the body with that same leg. Get a little rotation again. You can hold on for balance if you need it, but try to find it. Work on it a little here. Drawing in and up at the navel, right here. <laughs> there you go, swing it out. Woo! We're gonna switch sides now, forward and back. Oop. Here we go, forward and back, swing it out. Oh, it feels good. Stand tall, find your balance, hold on if you need to. I'm struggling with mine today. Let's go across the body in front here, okay? Swing it around, wrap it around a little bit, get a little twist. There you go. Nice work. Keep them coming. Three, two, and one. All right, we're gonna come over. I'm gonna show you here, you can use the wall and push your hips back. I'm gonna use my bench here. All right, so pretend your hands are at the wall, or do put your hands at the wall, pretend mine are at the wall. And we're just gonna bring that head down between the shoulders, and then come back up into that plank with your hands at the wall, okay? Let's do a couple more, just fall down be below the shoulders there and the arms, and then back up, release it, push those hips back, hinge. Ooh, that feels so good. And back up, does it? Tell me, let me know, comment. Don't forget to subscribe today either. And rest, let's grab a 10 pound weight. We're just gonna do a counter squat just to kind of activate some muscles through the body here. Here we go, we're gonna raise it up as we squat. Right out in front, 
and then stand, okay? Just 30 seconds here. We're just trying to warm up a little. Blow that air out, draw the belly button in and up. Oh, I love this one for a nice warm up. Woo. Then we'll get a little bit of uh, footwork going here to just elevate the heart rate slightly. And we'll get going. It's gonna be a quick one. Again, pay attention to um, three, two, and one. Pay attention to what time. This is only about a 30 minute workout, a little over. The stretching makes it a little longer, okay? Here we go. We're gonna go scissors over the line on your floor if you have one, or pretend. Three, two, and one. We're just moving right here. If you wanna go side to side, quick feet. If you need to just tap, just tap it out, okay? See what you can do here, but a little bounce on the ball of your foot can be really good for you if you can get there, okay? I'm just going kind of side to side. And that's really all the warm up we're gonna do today. Three, two, and one. All right, so our first circuit here, we're gonna do a plank row. We're gonna do one side at a time. I'm gonna go with a 20. You can do this from the floor. And look at my modification window. You can use a box or a chair for that, okay? But we're gonna go here with a row on this first one. And then we're gonna use our stepper or our box again for a lateral step up. I'm gonna go a little high from the ground so I can get a little more range here. Let's go in that plank row. Three, two, and one. Rowing here. So you can do this from the floor as well, but I like this because I can let the weight kind of go a little bit further. I'm still working core a lot here, okay? Woo, that's it. Keep those feet squared off. Now, if you don't have a chair or box and you want to just go here as well, you can do that. Remember, there's modifications. Woo. We're gonna go 30 seconds, that's halfway. We're gonna switch to the other side now, okay? Same thing, feet are a little bit wider here. Keep that good form in your plank. Good. Whew. We've been working a lot of strength, pushing weight. Some of these things we're doing today are a little bit tougher because we're gonna have a lot of core in them while we're working these muscle groups. Whew. Three, two, and one, rest. All right, we have lateral step ups. I'm gonna be using my box here. I'm gonna go with 15 pounds on this. You might go body weight. Like I said, a lot of this could almost be done body weight. Maybe I'll, I'll turn this one into a body weight one if you wanna see it. We're gonna go up to the side here. Three, two, and one. Step it up. I want you to think about pushing into, driving into the hip laterally here, because it's easy to still step forward. So we're pushing into that hip. We wanna try not to drive off of that foot that's down. Woo, did you see that though? But press into the foot that's up. All right, so sometimes I just tap this toe down and push right back in and make sure that I'm not going off this foot that's down, really driving into the foot that's up on the box. Oh, good, that's halfway. We're gonna switch to the other side. Here we go, up and down, push. Heels down, okay, heels down. A lot of people will go up onto those toes. Try to stay back on the heel, press in to the side. You got it, team. Ooh, and try not to use the foot that's down. You can do it. Try to find that height. That box, your knee should be about 90 degrees or less and no more for today on this one. All right, we're going down to the floor. We're gonna work our hamstrings a little bit with a hold. If this is tough for you, you're gonna know that we need to work this more often. First, I just want you to lift your hips, find your glutes here, walk your feet out till you feel the hamstrings, the back of your thighs, keeping the hips up. Raise your right leg and hold. And now switch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
nine, ten. Switch two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine and 10, good job, all right. So I'm sorry, we kind of led into that quickly. 10 seconds on each leg there, working that. That was awesome. We're going back to that plank row. So find your weight here. Three, two, and one. Here we go, plank row. That's it, great job. These are your three exercises. We're just doing two rounds today. And the reason is, is because I've added some isolated biceps, triceps, trying to get those arms in there for you. I've had a few requests for that, so trying to work those in a little bit more here. Woo, there you go, you got it, team. Oh, keep rowing. Draw that navel in and up, squeeze the glutes halfway, switch sides, keep working. We're just getting right into it. No rest there, right over to the other side. Anyways, <laughs> back to that hamstring um, exercise we're doing. 10 seconds, one leg at a time. If you find it hard to be on one, just put two feet down, okay? We'll get, we'll get there. I'm gonna go right into counting when we get there. Three, two, and one rest, awesome. All right, here we go, lateral step ups. These are quick workouts. If you wanna see longer workouts, let me know. I like to spend a little more time on it, but I realize not all of us have the time. Maybe we're not there yet. That's okay. We're going back into these lateral step ups here, okay? Three, two, and one. Here we go. Drive into that heel and down. If you don't have one of these boxes, I highly recommend one, okay? Especially if you've been working out at home, start investing in little pieces of equipment for yourself. It's gonna make your workouts a little more fun. Yeah, 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 sure, Tato, but you're gonna get to do some variations and do some different things, which is nice. There we go, step it up. I do try to give you those modifications. Push into that hip. Oh, it feels good. Nice work. Ooh, uh. That's it, switch sides. I'm gonna go a little over. Sorry, went a little over. There you go, oop, oop, press up, press up. Lost my balance there, find your balance. You can even bring that knee up if you want. You can bring it out to the side if you want. There's so many variations. Work your balance. You can put that toe up if you need to because you don't have the balance right now, that's okay. Three, two, and one. Nice work, team. All right, we're going back to that single leg hamstring hold. All right, I'm sorry that I rushed into it last time. Hips are up, hopefully you're seeing my windows pop up. Walk it out, drive into the hamstrings here, lift. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Switch, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Switch. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Great job. All right, just a note on this one, and I'm sorry, I have a timer in there to keep us on track. We wanna make sure those hips don't fall. The more we drive that heel in and drive those hips up, the more we'll feel that activation and that hamstring working. All right, great job on that one. If that one really got to you, that means that we need to work on that strength. We're gonna do a kneeling curl to press and we have mountain climbers today. So kneeling curl to press, I'm gonna aim for 15s. We're gonna head down to the floor team. Squeeze those glutes. Put those toes down, here we go. Three, two, and one, curl to press. 
kneeling. If it bothers you to be on your knees, just stand and do this. You don't have to kneel, but I really do like the activation in the core here as we work. Woo, we're already halfway. It's an easy 30 seconds. <laughs> What's so easy about that, Tatum? I don't know, it sounded good. Here we go. We're almost there. Three, two, and one. I'm gonna go ahead and work through that rest just a bit there. Mountain climbers, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off, four of them. Three, two, and one. Walk it down the middle here. If you wanna run it, we can run it, okay? I'm gonna go a little faster for these 20 seconds, but feel free to tap it out, okay? There you go, keep working. We got it. Three, two, one. Nice work, rest, 10 seconds rest. Three more of these and we're back to those curl to presses, okay? Stay with me, we're moving fast. Three, two, and one, here we go. Oh gosh, guys, did you start your watches? I know I didn't. Here we go, all right, it's been a wash of a day. Anyways, it is what it is. We're here, we know it. Halfway, keep it coming. That's it. Hips are in line here, they're down. They're not up here, okay? Three, two, and one, rest. 10 seconds rest. If you're having trouble with your wrist, make a fist, okay? Did that rhyme again? Gosh, I'm getting good at rhyming in here. Three, two, and one. Here we go. Woo! That's it. See if you want to, if you want to go faster or jump it, we can jump it. I like to just run it down the middle. Hoo, hoo, come on. There you go. Woo! Three, two, one. Oh, rest. We should have one more here. One more, here we go. Three, two, and one. Woo, a little bit of core, a little bit of isolation on the arms today, just to help switch it up before we go into another circuit here today. There we go, come on. Woo, I'm gonna go to my knuckles. There you go, we're there, we're there. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh, wow, team, just grab those weights, stay on your knees unless it hurts and get to a standing position here. Here we go, three, two, and one. Curl to press, oh, a little tougher. Second time through, here we go. Last time through, everything is two sets today. Remember, if you want more and you have more time, go back through this one full round. You could hit each exercise in that last circuit again. This one more time and keep moving. I love working that way. Woo, there you go, come on. Three, two, and one, rest. Oh, who felt that? I did, here we go, mountain climbers again. Four of these, 20 on, 10 off. Three, two, and one, here we go, 20 seconds, let's work it, team. You're doing awesome, picking it up and be here in the middle, working quickly to fit all of this in. Halfway, now I do love 40, to 45 minute workouts. Three, two, and one. But you know why? At this point, it's just important that you show up each day and if working a little shorter workouts helps you get there, this is what we want for you, okay? Some consistency. Three, two, and one. Here we go. Run it out if you'd like or just tap, tap, tap. Woo! Here you go. Halfway, keep it coming. Three, two, whoo, and one. All right, just two more, two more. Three, two, and one. Here we go. That's it, that's it. You got this. Shoulders are over your wrist, okay? Shoulders over your wrist here. Three, two, and one. Oh, good job, team. One more here. Last one here before we move on. Three, two, and one. Do your best, give it a 10. On a scale of one to 10, let's work a 10 here. Go, go. That's it, that's it. Draw that navel in and up, tighten up here. 
There you go. Come on. We're there. Woo. Three, two, and one. Rest, just 30 seconds, okay? Short rest. If you need more, take it. We have a push-up, okay? I'm gonna go incline. You can do it from the floor, hand release. All right, we can go here if we don't have an incline here today. And then we have a reverse lunge to stick. And uh, we're gonna do wall sit with calf raises, okay? I'm gonna go incline. My shoulder's a little funky. I'm gonna see if this helps. And uh, just raise myself up a bit. That takes your shoulders out. You can use a wall or a chair. Three, two, and one. Here we go, push-ups. Good. 30 seconds of work here. Halfway, team. Woo. Three, two, and one. Great job. All right, we have a reverse lunge with a stick. Let's stay with one side, and then we'll move on to the other, okay? So we're gonna exhaust one side. We're gonna reverse lunge up to stick, if you want, or just a reverse lunge to stand, okay? Here we go. Three, two, and one. Reverse. And stay, I'm gonna stay with this one side. 30 seconds, halfway, we'll switch to the other. Good. You got it. We're gonna feel a little bit of the legs here. As we go into that wall sit, we're gonna just do our best. There we go. And switch, halfway. Oh. Here you go, big smile. We're getting through it. There you go. So we have a little unilateral work today on the legs with those lateral step ups and these lunges. It means we're working one side at a time. Really good work on balance, stability. Three, two, and one. Helps us equal out that strength, all right? Okay, we're gonna go wall sit with calf raises. You don't have to do the cat raise, cat, calf raises. It's been a long day. <laughs> Here we go, we're gonna sit, try to get down to 90 degrees. I'm gonna raise my hips up, or hips, my calves, you, you're just gonna have to try to make sense of this. Here we go, up and down, 45 seconds on the clock here. All right, does that mean you have to go 45? No, if we're not there, we're not there. Hold it as long as you can, okay? It's okay, I want you to work on building. That gives you something to work towards, okay? We're gonna try to build to that 45. Today it might be 20, might be 30, we're halfway. You can stand up for 10, five seconds and get back to it if you need to. Just do your best. You will progress if you keep practicing. Ooh, here we go. Eight seconds, hang on to it. Oh, breathe through it. Go to your happy place. Three, two, and one. <laughs> oh, rest, we only have one more round, okay? We can get through it, we can do it. From the floor, push-ups, from a wall a box, a bench, whatever you need here. We have our push-ups, okay? We're going in seven seconds. Oh, we got this. You can do this. Three, two, and one. And I didn't give you something to focus on today. And I get all these things online or the, you know, but just thinking about, you know, putting yourself first, um, you know, loving yourself. Um, this doesn't mean that you need to be selfish and not help others or love others and only put yourself first every time. But if we learn to really admire ourselves, you know, be our true selves, that will shine elsewhere. We'll be able to love others and spread some of that around. Good, time, time team. So think about that. That was a quick, that was quick. I don't know, it felt too quick. <laughs> reverse lunge now to stick if you want or just a reverse lunge. Here we go team, three, two, and one. What is it that I read somewhere? Be your own kind of beautiful. Be your own kind of beautiful. I love that. All right. Don't worry about being perfect. 
I'm not. Listen to me tonight. <laughs> oh, life gets in the way. It's hard. Oh. Ooh, just be yourself. That way you'll attract the people that whew, switch. What are you telling me, kid? You'll attract those people that are more like you. Not that we shouldn't have diversity, or that at least respect who you are, um, who enjoy you for who you are, which is always a great thing. Oh, and you'll be able to, to be joyful around others when you're just being yourself. Oh. Three, two, and one. I don't know why I'm focused on that so much this month. I just think the world is a crazy place. All right, here we go. It's good, though. <laughs> here we go. We're going to come down to that wall, sit. We're going to go calf raises. About to send my daughter off to college after this year. Maybe that's part of it. Here we go. Three, two, and one. We have just a wall sit. You can add those calf raises if you want. You're going as long as you can here, up to 45 seconds. Yeah, anybody else have kids out there at college or moving off into the world with some independence? Can't say. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't worried. <laughs> She'll be fine. She'll be fine. But you don't want them to get lost. We're halfway team. Just keep it coming. Sorry. This feels like a therapy session. Sorry. We'll take that. <laughs> Save that for later. There we go. Up and down. Woo. That's it. Come on. We got it. Three. Two and one. Yes, team. All right. One last little circuit here. We're going to go kneeling overhead tricep extensions. Uh, you might have remembered these recently. 20 or 25 pounds. I think I'm just going to go with that 20 today. So we're going to kneel back down like we did our curl to press. Hold the weight and extend, okay? After that, we have mountain climbers again, that 2010. What, Tatum? Heck yeah. But we can use an incline if you're tired, and we're gonna cross the body, or you can come down to the floor. Three, two, and one. Let's hit those triceps. Lots of arms lately. Just adding some isolation into some of these workouts. There you go, extend. Let me face you, breathe. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. You got this, team. Woo, try to keep that upper arm stationary. Three, two, and one. Rest, all right? Cross body mountain climbers. That means we're gonna bring opposing knee to arm here, okay? Cross the body. Three, two, and one. Here we go. Cross it over. You can use an incline if you want. I might even go there today. I might even go there today. Halfway. Keep working, it's 20 seconds. Cross, cross, cross. Three, two, and one, good job. I'm gonna try this at the incline, see how it feels. Just get you off your shoulders a little bit, gives you some space. Makes it a little easier on the core. Three, two, and one, here we go. Cross it, cross. That's it. You can go here, march it. You can run it, we're halfway. Good, three, two, and one. Rest. All right, I'm gonna stay here. That feels quite good, still tough enough. Three, two, and one, here we go. You can go back to that floor if you don't have an incline. You can use a chair, even go higher with it if you want. Oh, good, that's it, that's it. Light on those feet, three, two, one. Oh, good job. Remember, we do have two rounds of these. We're gonna go back to that tricep extension, okay? Three, two, and one. Last 20 seconds here before we go back to the triceps. Run it out, good. Here we go. Three, two, one. So I did go incline. Not only does it make it a little bit easier, not really, it's still hard. 
but it does take some of that pressure off the shoulders and the wrists if you need it, which I need it today. Three, two, and one. Here we go. Triceps. Three, good. Four, I hope you're enjoying this workout. If you are, please don't forget to like and subscribe. All right, help us keep this going. Woo, halfway. That's it, come on team. Ooh, just even to show your support, leave a comment. Ooh, three, two, and one, rest. All right, back to those mountain climbers. I'm gonna lower it just one more. This is what I love about this box. You can find some different levels. Three, two, and one, here we go. Cross the body. Good, that's it, halfway. Keep it coming. Don't give in. You got it. Three, two, and one. Oh, way to go, way to go. Three, one down, three to go, okay? Oh, let's do this. Three, two, and one. Halfway. Three, two, one. <laughs> yeah, all right. Doesn't it feel so good? Isn't this fun? Yes, the big F word, fun. I love it. Three, two, and one. Here we go. Cross it out. <sighs> Again, remember, just pace yourself if you need to. <sighs> but keep working. Maybe just find a high plank. Maybe we just stop there when it gets to be too much, but we're still working. <sighs> Three, two, and one. Rest. Yeah, remember that high plank. That way you keep working. You're, you're still holding a plank and you're gonna get there and be able to do these mountain climbers longer. Three, two, and one. Last one, team. Let's run it out. Do the best you can. Give it your all to the finish line. Let's do it. Good. Three, two, one. Cool down, it sounds nice. All right, create some space. We have about five minutes. Let's grab a sip of water. Oh, oh. Okay, let's start with just a little shoulder here. Bring the arm across, look away, shoulders down. Oh, nice work, nice work, you did great. I know that might have challenged you. We probably got a little uncomfortable, and that's okay, all right? That's where growth happens. All right, we can't change if we do the same thing all the time. Oh, let's switch, other side. So we have to get a little uncomfortable. Again, just modify. If there's something you don't, if there's something that we do in here that's not working for you, I haven't given you a modification, you're not sure what to do, Send me a message, okay? I am happy to help you. It is my goal to keep you moving safely, okay? But to keep you moving, so let me know. I don't bite. <laughs> I do love to help, <laughs> or I wouldn't be here. All right, great job. Woo, feeling that. Let's just swing it out here. All right, let's kick that left leg out. We're gonna push the hips back. Push those hips back. Stretch there. Breathe. Feel the inside of that leg. Bring it up. We're gonna place a hand down by our side. I want you to reach up oh no, over in that side bend. Keep those hips forward. They're gonna to wanna to push back and give into that stretch. Push them forward. Maybe go up on your fingertips to get here like me. Look up or look down. Good, bring it back. We're gonna slide up over to the other side this time. Hips forward. Great job, let's switch it out. Right leg kicks out, bend that left knee, sit it back, ooh, feel the difference. <laughs> Stretch it out, breathe into it. Maybe you go to your forearms, maybe you stay high. Hold it here. 
Don't forget to breathe into your nose, out to your mouth. I want deep breaths. Let it go. Good. Let's reach up and over, pushing those hips forward. Look down or look up. Again, finding your breath. Don't forget it. Woo. Up and over, other side. Nice work. All right, now let's bring those toes together, knees wide. Push back here for just a second. I want you to bring the hands towards the middle. I want you to slide your left arm under your right here. Bring your temple to the floor and just twist here for me. Push both hands into the floor. Good. Bring that left arm out. Switch it with the right, okay? So bring that right arm under, temple to the floor. Relax and breathe. Bring it back out. Let's lay down on our back where we can get our hips real quick. I want you to bring that right leg over the left here. Reach around on the back of that thigh if you can and draw it in. You can also just hold here. You can grab your shin if you need a deeper stretch, okay? Breathe. Extend that left leg, pull the toes back. Good, put that foot down, cross that left leg over the right, reach behind, let that hip go, breathe into it. Raise that right leg, pull the toes back. Good, let it go. Bring those knees in, rock side to side. And we are done, team. You made it through another TXT workout. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me. It's always more fun with you here. I can't wait to see you next time. If you have any questions, let me know. I'm here for you. And uh, have a fabulous day, okay? Bye-bye.